Hi everyone, I hope this video finds you all okay and that you're doing well all of you at this difficult time of our life and since today is the first day of Passover I decided to read you the story from our book about Moses in the basket. So that's how it goes. Years without numbers went by a new pharaoh ruled over Egypt. He did not remember Joseph and all the good Joseph had done. Pharaoh said to his people, Look, these people called Israel grew many and strong. Perhaps they will make war against us and kill us. Let us make them slaves. So Pharaoh put the Israelites to work, making bricks and building great cities. But the harder they worked, the stronger they became. And Pharaoh grew frightened. At least Pharaoh sent out an order saying, if the Hebrew give birth to a baby girl, she shall live. But if they give a birth to a boy child, he shall be put in the river and drowned. These were dark days for the people of Israel. Many children were killed. Mothers and fathers everywhere wept in sadness. Just then, among the Israelites, Amram, and his wife, Yochevet, had baby boy. Yochevet hid her son, keeping him safe for three months. But the time came when he grew too large to hide. Yochevet had a plan. She took reeds from the river and wove a basket, inside and out. She covered the basket with tar, making it into a little ark. She placed her baby son in the basket. Then she took the basket down to the river and set it out to float. Yochevet said to her daughter Miriam, Come back and tell me what happened. Miriam hid the reeds by the riverside. She watched the basket and wondered what would happen to her baby brother. Then that afternoon, the Pharaoh's daughter came to the river to bath. Out of the corner of, the, uh, of her eye, she saw the little basket floating in the short reeds. When she opened the basket, a baby reached out its tiny hand to her. Pharaoh's daughter took the baby gently in her arms and held it close. This is Hebrew child, she said. Miriam saw this and came out of hiding. Oh, princess, she said, I know I, I can find a Hebrew woman to help you care for the child. Yes, said the Pharaoh's daughter, for I shall keep this child as my own. Miriam went home and told her mother all that had happened. Miriam and Yochevet hurried to the, palace, to the palace gate. Pharaoh's daughter met them and said, take the child and feed and care for him. When he is older, bring him back to me and I will raise him up to be a prince of Egypt. Yocheved did just as Pharaoh's daughter asked. When the time came, she brought the baby boy back to the palace and Pharaoh's daughters took him 
as her own son. And Pharaoh's daughter named him Moses, which means pulled from the water. So this is this story. The rest of it, you know what happened. Mon Moses, of course, grew up in the palace and he ended up taking all the Israelites out of Egypt to Israel. And I wish you all happy Passover and a kosher Passover. And please stay safe and be well. And I miss everybody in my class. I miss all the children that I know in Sunday school. And please, please have a happy, happy Passover. Bye.